Saturday, everyone. It, it is definitely not morning right now. It's 9.30 at night here, and I owe you an explanation. You see, I've been off adventuring today. Wherever did you go on your adventure, Melissa? Wow, that is a great question, viewers. I got outside the reed bubble. What is that? What another great question. The reed bubble is basically is when students are so involved in like their schoolwork or partying on campus that they never actually leave reed campus. And that is a huge problem around here. Actually, last weekend was really the first time I've been off campus for anything other than groceries since I got here, and that was a month. So, it's a real thing, and I was suffering from it. But I'll get back to that later. It has been a weird week. Most of the time, my weeks, they just kind of go like, But this week was... And then it was down, like, you can't even see how far low it was for a while. And then it's been pretty much up here for the rest of it. So that's what I've been dealing with. I won't get into details to save you and myself both the painful experience. But I will go into the details on the awesome things that happened. Like this morning, I ran a 5K. That's right. And I got a t-shirt for it. I ran with uh, a couple of my friends from my dorm and I finished, I ran the whole thing, I didn't stop, and it was kind of terrible. Then I got free pancakes afterwards and it was much less terrible. And then like a group of friends and I went exploring around Portland. Yay! We went to like the Goodwill outlet store where basically they don't sort through any of the things they get, they just dump them into giant bins and you sort through and if you find something you like then you take it and then at the end they just weigh how much you have. They don't even go by items. And then we went to the famous Voodoo Donuts uh, in downtown Portland and we all got a donut and we ate them and it was really great. And I did research for a story that I'm going to write. I'm so excited about writing it. And then we went to Powell's bookstore and spent a really long time in there. If you don't know anything about Powell's, it is a giant bookstore. It's really big. And then one of my friends got her ears pierced, which was exciting. Then we got food and then we came home. And, you know, so even though this week has been hard, it just goes to show that I have a really great group of friends here. I can't even express into words how thankful I am for that. I probably would have been in a really bad place if it hadn't been for my friends. You know, there were a couple of us that were having a rough time this week and we would just check in on each other. Just every once in a while ask, hey, how you doing? And we do things for each other and we are going to cuddle and watch Mulan tonight because we all need physical contact. College is, is really great. I like college. Some of the particular moments I'm not a fan of, but in general, I've been here for a month and I have had so much fun. I'm glad I ended up here and I hope that you all someday find that you are in a place that you are glad that you ended up at. It doesn't have to be a forever home. It can be a temporary place like college generally is. But even just for a little while, you know, have a group of friends that you can just hang out with, eat cookies, and roll around in comforters, and watch Mulan with, and also explore Portland. Yeah, I'm gonna leave you on a good note tonight because I'm in a great mood, and I hope that you guys have a great week as well.